the first day of the Spookathon did not go as planned. So I'm going to tell you why. The first thing that I'm starting this with is the fact that I worked 12 hours today. Now, to set you up with the backstory, um, where I live in the northeast of the U.S., half of the year we are on the dark side of the moon, and um, me starting work and ending work at 7 and 7.30 p.m. means that I'm only outside um, of work hours when it's dark out, when it's dark out. So I woke up today to get ready for my 7 a.m. shift. It was pitch black. I couldn't vlog for you. Um, work was very, very, very busy. Although I was able to host a Twitter sprint, which I think was pretty successful. I actually got in the two and a half hours of my first bit of my morning, I was able to read like over 100 pages. I think I'm on page 119 of Toil and Trouble, which I really, really do like um, so far. I really like it. Um, but soon after I finished the sprint and I read a little bit more when I was able to at my desk at work, things just exploded. So I was unavailable until when I got out of work at 7.30. Um, and then I had to drive. I had to go to rehearsal for a show that I'm in right now. And I was at rehearsal for three hours and then I drove home. And now here it is. You want to see what time it is? It's, um, it's 10.33 at night. So this is the first time that I'm able to pick up a camera 10.33 night. Um, I really wanted to have a cute little day one vlog. I, I mean, I even wore my, my bone cardigan. Like, I always wear this thing, like, when things are spooky, and I love wearing it for Spookathon. So, but I just did not have a chance to do anything interesting or film for you in any kind of way. So, you know, I'm home now. I scarfed down some dinner that Tim had made to make this amazing dinner, and I could really enjoy none of it. Um, I had to take a shower big time because I am gross um, and clean up my room because um, I, it, I, it, I don't know how much this is saying, but you have the good angle because everything behind you is an atrocity. Um, I'm going to take a shower, lay down, and I'm going to read some more of Toil and Trouble um, and sleep the, this day off. Start fresh tomorrow. To tomorrow, I am off of work. I do have a rehearsal in the evening, but I have plenty of enough time in the day where I can do other things and maybe even read. So hopefully tomorrow's vlog is more interesting. And it's not just me being a sad sack on my carpet and talking to you about how I didn't do anything interesting with my day. Um, I didn't do my Instagram photo challenge. Um, I'm going to hopefully just catch up on some and try to maybe to get ahead a little bit. Um, tomorrow when I have some time. So that's all I have to say. Um, it didn't go as planned. Um, I didn't get to do anything cute or interesting for day one, but it is what it is. Hopefully, you know, I have some better days. It's just how it is being a person in the world that has work and family and other obligations. Sometimes, sometimes you can't pick what things occupy your time. But I will say, I have started Toil and Trouble. I very much like it. I'm very much looking forward to laying down after my shower and reading it. And I'm going to go to bed. I will see you tomorrow um, for Spookathon Day 2. <laughs> Bye. Good morning. It is day two. As much as I woke up thinking, okay, I'm going to have day two start off on a wonderful foot. It really wasn't. <laughs> um... So let's pow out a little bit. So first things first, both girls were up late last night um, with stomach issues or feeling not well or something of that, that nature. Amelia kept waking up saying that she didn't feel well. Thor actually woke up and threw up in the middle of the night. We don't know why. She didn't seem sick at all throughout the day. So the, it came basically down to this morning, the discussion with 35 minutes that we had to get the girls ready in the mornings. Who was going to go to school? Who wasn't? If they both were, if they both were going to stay home and how that was going to affect the rest of our day. <sighs> so the official determination was made that they're both just going to go to school. Amelia said that she felt a whole lot better, but she also has been known to lie because she does not like to miss school. Um, and Thora, she kind of did seem a little under the weather, a little irritable, but that could have been a, for a couple reasons. Um, 
Plus, she's only in preschool for two hours a day, so I'm just hoping that she can kind of get through it just fine. She already has tomorrow off, which is another reason that I didn't want her to miss because she's already gonna be off of school tomorrow. All right, that's a little better. Not amazingly better, but I can live with it for now. All right, I am going out. I have to go to the store and then I am gonna go to Starbucks. I'm gonna sit and I'm gonna read some of my book. Um, interesting factoid about me right now. I have to walk to my car in my socks because the shoes that I am wearing today are in my car. So, so yeah, I'd, I'd say that things are going really well for me today. guys um it's 10 to 11 i'm heading back home to um get thor off her preschool bus and then when she gets home we're gonna hang out um in the living room until lunchtime and then nap time i have like a bad headache and i need to get home and take something um to head off the pain because if i don't i can easily get kicked into a migraine i'm not about that also when i was reviewing um, the footage that I had taken over the past like hour or so I found there was a huge chunk of footage that I had accidentally recorded of the, me driving in the car I'm almost at page 200 of toil and trouble and um, I'm not anywhere near done and I don't know if I'm gonna be done today <laughs> Um, let's see, as far as the rest of the day's plans go, there really isn't a whole lot. Um, also, by the way, I am not looking at the camera, I am driving. So I know that sometimes people get worried. I have not looked at the camera lens once, and I know you can't tell because I have sunglasses on, but anyway. Um, nothing else is really planned. Once the girls get home, we're just going to hang out a little bit. It's a very, very nice day. It's getting chilly. It's in the 40 degrees range anymore. Um, but especially because they kind of possibly don't feel so amazing a piece. Um, I don't want to possibly make it worse and have them go outside or play or anything until I know that they're both fine. So I'm heading home and I'll check. Oh, it's bright. Oh geez. It's sunny. I'll check in with you later. Alrighty. I'm home. Thora's home. She's watching a little bit of TV. I am just gonna rest on the couch for a little bit and hope that this um, Tylenol kicks in soon because my head does not feel that great. Hope I didn't miss my window to like head off a bad headache. But I am gonna relax. Maybe I can read a couple pages of my book. And I have some little couch buddies here with me. So, yeah, we're gonna kinda hang out a little bit. <laughs> Alrighty, mom mode activated. I am attempting to sprint and also make lunch at the same time. Jaws all drop at the candy shop when we walk in the store. It's a frightening display. Mothers had their children's eyes and hurry to. Hey everybody! So it's like 6:39 or something. Um, lots of time has passed since my last clip. I we had lunch. I laid the way down for a nap, and then I um I couldn't film because my camera was full, so I had to upload some footage. And I started editing the past two days. 
Um, and then my dad came over, so we, we, I didn't really get a lot of reading done. I did, however, take a couple um, bookish photographs for the past couple days spookathon challenges, so I did get something bookish related done today. Um, but I'm about to leave in a few minutes to go to rehearsal. Um, I will, I'm going to bring Twill and Trouble with me and read a little bit as I can when I'm not um, doing work. But um, otherwise, the biggest portion of my reading today is going to be when I come home when I get ready for bed, lay down in bed. So we'll see how much I get done. Uh, that's it. I'll update you later on tonight. Yes, oh my God, Dr. Jack, there is no Dr. Jack. There's only Edward Hyde. <laughs> <laughs> We're in a little bit of a lull in between stuff that we're working on, so I'm taking this time to read a couple pages of my book. I'm on 2.12. As you can see, we are being very productive in our reading right now. <laughs> I was reading. Yeah. Yeah. Then but, you came home. But we're not now. <laughs>